it's Cool Tool Tuesday. And I gotta tell you this, that this thing right here may be the best $10 that I have spent in a very long time. I'm gonna tell you what this is and how I use it coming up next. Hi everybody, I'm Lee of CJ and Terrell, and if this is your first time here, geez, I just want to say welcome. We're a home improvement channel where we welcome everybody, beginners as well. And what I want to tell you is this, it's Cool Tool Tuesday, one of my favorite days, okay? Because I get the opportunity to share a tool with you that I think is either a money saver, a time saver, or just doggone cool. Okay, so this is it. This is a parachute bag. I'm going to turn it around. It's got a drawstring here. I'm going to open this up. There are six compartments. The pockets are very deep and it's made out of very durable material. Now what I like about it is it keeps the screws or nails that I use on a daily or weekly basis at the ready. I don't have to go hunting for, for example, if I need a 16D common, it's right there. I know exactly where it is because it's in the parachute bag with the hardware that I use most of the time. Now, one of the things I've done with my parachute bag is I've lined the bottom of the pockets with a piece of rubber. And what that does is it just reinforces the bottom because nails are sharp and that way I don't have to worry about them poking through the bottom of the bag. Now each one of these individual pockets, they're self-contained, so you don't have to worry about cross-contamination. Then when you're finished using it, you just cinch it up with the drawstring, nice and tight. And I, I, I even like the handle, because it makes it easy to transport. So when you pull the drawstring, it, it flattens it out a little bit and makes it really manageable to stack. Now, over the years, I've shown you a few organizing tips for nuts and bolts and fasteners and stuff. I gotta tell you, this by far is the most simple that I've come across, I really like it a lot. I will also tell you this, they're hard to find. I had to go to several stores before I found a parachute bag. So your best bet may be finding it online. You know, sometimes it's just the really small things that you would think wouldn't make a big impact in a shop. I gotta tell you, this is one of those small things that makes a big impact. It's not a big table saw or a lathe or a router. It's just a small bag and it's helped me considerably. This is Leah saying you can do this. See you next time.